Hi, my name is Jake Miller and you're at the NZ Startup Bootcamp. Kia ora koutou, I'm Kendall Flutie. I'm one of the co-founders and the CEO of Bank. Sorry I can't be with you to share what's going to be an incredibly exciting weekend for you all. Hi, my name is Samantha Gadd. I'm the founder and CEO of Humankind and also the co-founder of Kin. Thinking about starting a business, there's some really key do's and some really key don'ts that you need to think about. Don't hesitate. Um, when we first started our business at Otago Uni, it was kind of a big decision whether we wanted to stop university and try to do this business thing. And I think um, we realised that you've got just as much chance as getting fired from a conventional job um, as you do as failing at a business. So if I was to give you one piece of advice um, around what to do or, or not do when you're starting a business, it's to not just focus on the dollars, to ensure that what you're doing, the idea that you run with, um, what you want to turn your venture into, it really ties into what you're passionate about. Every day, every meeting, every key decision, I'm always asking myself what defines success. It's very easy to lose sight of the end game and get distracted by the things going on around you that ultimately don't really matter. Recognise that everything only lasts for a moment and that goes for the highs and the lows. Um, being in business is absolutely a roller coaster, and sometimes things don't go your way or you haven't hit a target or something's going on in your team that's stressing you out. Just remember that although it feels terrible at the time, that moment will absolutely pass. And same with the highs, so enjoy those highs when they come, when you get a win, when things are humming, make sure you celebrate those um, because also that moment will pass. The one big thing I want to say to everyone is when you're thinking about starting a business is you've actually got to do it. The amount of people that I talk to who have had these great ideas and always think, you know, tomorrow I'm going to start this idea, tomorrow I'm going to launch this business, and tomorrow never comes about, right? Because it is difficult, and the older you get, the harder it is because you've got more responsibilities. You know, you've got mortgages and families and children and everything else. So the ability to get in there and start it and actually take a punt is really, really important. Inevitably, if a business is going to be successful, it's going to take over your life and probably take a couple of years to get going. Um, so you want to make sure it's something you're passionate about. I wouldn't just get into it to try and get rich or get money quickly. You want to do something that you really believe in and something that's going to get you out of bed in the morning. Entrepreneurs in the world come up with solutions to painful problems that consumers have. I think so often as entrepreneurs we get excited when we're out running or when, when we're in the shower and we come up with what we think will be a great idea that will change the world. But we forget what problem does it solve, what market does it serve and are we actually passionate about solving that problem. All of those things need to be thought about so go out find problems and build solutions to those problems and I think you'll have a much greater chance of building a successful business in the long term. So have a great fantastic weekend I wish you every success and can't wait to hear uh, some of the great outcomes thank you.